I am in the Ted Tinling row of dresses, and this is very special because I was honored to be dressed by Ted, and he was iconic. He was special and an incredible designer. Ted was very particular in making sure that everybody he dressed felt comfortable and they had basically their own style. I had about 10 to 15 dresses a year made by Ted and they were always colorful, they were always gonna be cotton, they were always gonna be pretty much eyelet. Everybody kinda had their own look. So let me show you a few dresses that I've found here. This is a treasure trove. This dress and jacket Rosie Casals beat me in this dress because I remember I was 14 years old and Rosie comes out in this black velvet, gorgeous, this should be in a nightclub, with rhinestones and beats me. I mean, this one has gotta be iconic. Ground control to Major Tom. <laughs> That's a crazy one. With little shorts. This is so heavy. I mean, you gotta be pretty strong. This is an extra three pounds that you're carrying around when you're trying to win a two out of three set match. In the heat, possibly. This to me looks like a Martina dress. It's got a little bit of a flare, and of course the Virginia Slims logo. This is light. Martina wanted to win. She didn't want any extra heaviness. I think it's really important that the Hall of Fame preserves all of this fashion because Virginia Slims was so important to women's tennis to give the money for the tour to start and the fact that they knew how important it was to have the woman dress well because it was part of the whole entertainment package. And I think people would be really interested. 